This is Tech Week with your host, Jacob Kresge. Welcome to Tech Week Review. I'm Jacob Kresge. Uh, today we're going to review a 32 gigabyte iPod Touch. That's right. And um, we're also going to review an older iPod model. Um, we are happy that we are able to do widescreen format tonight. Um, you can visit us. A quicker way to get to our webpage is um, techweek.tk. That's techweek.tk. It'll take you right to our YouTube page. Quick, nice, easy link to get there. Um, so we're going to go ahead and start with our iPod 32 gigabyte touch. Okay, right now we have our iPod. It boots up with the Apple screen. A uh, nice feature is its um, unlock. You have to slide it to unlock it. Um, the iPod 32, uh, iPod 16, and iPod 8 gig are all pretty much the same. It's just how much storage. The new iPods um, are contoured to fit into your hand. They are curved, unlike uh, the original ones. If you order it directly from Apple, they have free engraving as a limited time. has an acrometer inside, so we're in music, so we can scroll back and forth between what songs we want to listen to, and then click it, and it'll play the song. We have, uh, on these iPods, they have internal speakers. Um, the speaker is actually inside the dock port here. Um, you can control the volume from the new volume buttons right on the side. And then it shows you on the front that the volume is being changed. Just moving it down there by using the side button. Or, if you're at the home screen, it'll pop it up just like it does on your Mac. Um, again, the same flicking motion. Uh, you can install tons of apps. There's an endless supply of them, like IM Plus for instant messaging. Um, To-do lists. My favorite AOL and Pandora Radio. Uh, metrodomes. Again, you can go into video and load videos. It's got good quality video. And then you have your Safari internet. What this does is it syncs right up with your Wi-Fi. Like here's our YouTube page or Motorola uh, V3M review. And you can click that and it'll actually load the movie using YouTube. You can view YouTube right on here. Um, it has a special YouTube button. Uh, settings. Uh, you can have Facebook, edit Facebook. Um, you also have maps. You can find directions if you're in a Wi-Fi area. Um, it, unlike the iPhone, you actually have to be in an area with Wi-Fi to get things to connect. Uh, we'll go into settings here. You can select your wireless internet. Like right now, we're connected to my wireless network. Um, you can go in and actually edit your settings for wireless and set it through a proxy. Um, again, full internet usage, just like on a regular iPhone or on an actual computer. It comes with the standard earbuds that Apple has and the headphone jack is actually at the bottom just like the new players unlike the 30 gig iPod your original video and the classics this is at the bottom. A cool feature, double tap the home button here and you can edit your music and change what actually song you're listening to and the volume and everything.
Um, you can buy, like we have here, we've got a screen protector. Um, it's a good idea to get. Um, it comes with the polishing cloth here. Uh, one bad thing is that the iPod does get pretty greasy, especially if you have greasy hands. You can buy a case like this. This case actually has a stand from Best Buy and Circuit City. And it just snaps right on, easy to get on, easy to get off. It'll protect your iPod. Um, the iPod comes with a adapter to plug it in. This is different than the iPod Classic adapter. The Classic still works, but it's actually much more thinner. There is no button on the side. This is the original. This is what they have now. Um, it'll fit on any standard docking port. If you have a dock for your uh, old iPod, you decide to get a new one, it should fit. Um, it's a big upgrade, and for those of you that um, have the Nike shoes uh, with the iPod support in it, you can actually run and it'll tell you uh, how much you've ran. Um, again, it's mercury free, um, arsenic free, 163 pixels per inch, um, very good headphones, it's got TV out capabilities. Timer. Battery power for this is up to 36 hours music time when fully played, 6 hours of video. Um, it can be charged with power adapter or to computer. Fast charge time is 2 hours, full charge is 4. Compatible with both Mac and Windows. Um, basically, um, good iPod, A+. Uh, I give this a 5 out of 5 stars. Um, I've had mine for about a month now, and I love it. Um, recommending people to get it. This would be definitely a big upgrade from an old iPod video or something. Uh, now we're going to go ahead and review an older one, and we're going to compare it to the new one. Alright, this is the old version or the iPod Classic, you can see. First of all, uh, we'd like to introduce uh, Frickin' O Frank. Check out his YouTube account. It's Frickin' Zero Fr Frank. That's F R I K E N Zero F R A N K. And, and he's here joining us to uh, review his iPod. Yes. This is the iPod Classic. It is a 30 gig, and it's in a case right now. It is black, or slate. Black. Black. <laughs> and it has that button up there that holds it. Has it has a uh, lock and lock feature. And headphone, headphone jack, jack. And a... Uh, click wheel. Yes. Yeah, uh, click wheel. And it's that's the only thing that's like this. That just turns. Uh, that's how you access all of your picks and everything. If you're wanting a cheap, affordable iPod, um, you can get a used one. They sell the new classics. This one does not have cover flow. It's the old version. But the new ones seem to work great. They're just like this. Um, hit the inner button there. Um, so, uh, in comparison, if you want a cheaper iPod, you could get an iPod Classic. If you're going to store a load of uh, video, get get an iPod Classic. Um, they have a if you like touchscreen, or um, if you are into uh, getting on the internet constantly all the time, then I would get an iPod Touch because you can't do that on a classic iPod. Anything else? Um, this can hold a lot of video. I have like ten videos, and also listen to the song. Yeah, awesome. Okay, they come with the same earbuds. Um, if you get it, you'll be getting the classic iPod uh, used. It supports video, like we said earlier, because it if is the you, iPod video. Yeah, the iPod video used. If you get a classic one, you can get it straight from Apple, brand new. Um, so these are your new choices. Hopefully we'll have someone on the show with a nanochromatic eventually, but we don't have one here today. Um, we thank you for watching.